Hello guys and welcome to another UK random video. Right, so today I have a special guest. It's Larry. Hello everyone. <laughs> so what we've done, or what I've done, I bought two mystery boxes. We have one DC mystery box, which I'll be opening. And we have a Star Wars mystery box, which Larry will be opening. So we're going to have a mystery box battle. We're going to see whose box is better. Okay. There's your box, young man. Thank you. I'm really excited. <laughs> it's, an, it's an honour to be here in your man cave. <laughs> <laughs> now, this I've been waiting for this for a long time now. And these uh, mystery boxes, I saw them on Zavi. And they were... I think they were 20 or 25 pounds each but it was two for 30 and i thought you know what what the hell why not so i've got one each for us like i said mine's dc larry's is star wars hopefully we get some good stuff in here Thank and you. um what we get we'll open them we're not going to look in we'll just take one item at a time each and go from there so i'll open or we'll slice this one and uh, hell, i'll do I don't like I was giving him a little uh, snip. <laughs> right, so as my guest, okay. just open it, flip the lid, or oh, leave the lid. Uh, and yeah, you pull the first one out, okay. and we'll see what we are. Uh... Oh, shit, you've got some oh. good stuff. Okay, <laughs> here we go. I should have got the Star Wars box. I'm going to start off with a small one. You know what? Hold that thought. I'm putting this table over a bit and you're coming over a bit yeah. more because you need to be in shot. Go on, pick what, what have you found? Okay. What have you found? Oh, that is nice. Is it a Star Wars coin? coin? Yeah, it's a collectible coin. I don't know if you can see that. A bit of this shot. Was that Chewbacca? Chewbacca? Wow. That's nice. I like that. That is really cool. Yeah. Is that gold as well? Where's my one? I actually got one a few weeks ago, one of my other mystery boxes. It was the mega anniversary one, one that had like £150 worth of value. And after we finished videoing, <clears throat> we actually looked in the box and we saw this was right in the bottom under the cardboard uh, in the box. And it's actually Jabba the Hut. I don't know how well you can see that, but that's really yeah. cool. And, I love that um, Chewbacca. They've only made a thousand of them. And this is 932 with a thousand. Wow. So that's probably worth like a million. What do you reckon? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that, but yeah, that's a nice, uh, you know, I would be happy with that in my collection. Yeah. Yeah. So far, so yeah. good. Larry's happy. Yeah. Um, should that put them behind one. us. Yeah. yeah make uh, it easier. Yeah. <clears throat> well, Zabby has started using uh, packaging. So I'm conflicted now because I'm a huge DC fan, so I'm hoping you're going to get something good. This is quite small. It's a little tip. Okay, so it's a DC Bombshells um, little vinyl figure. It's a mystery, mystery box, mystery tin, whatever you want to call it. These, so these are the DC Bombshells. Um, basically, it's the females from yeah. DC, and they've made them look like 1940s Ooh. style. What they would look like in the 40s. Which is really cool, like my Harley Quinn up there. <clears throat> yeah, and I've got Catwoman and Batgirl. Yeah, yeah, it's nice. Let's open this up and see yeah. what's in here. Uh, so you've got the usual suspects, plus there's a couple of uh, mystery ones as well. So this is series two, and there's 12 to collect. Let's open it. Oh, please be Lois Lane. I don't know if Lois Lane's one of them. Yeah, she's one of them. Was she in there? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Or Wonder Woman. Oh, I think one of back girl. Yes, it is. Okay. Yeah. Wow. That's a nice one, Kyle. I don't know if you can see her through the wrappers. Wow. What do you think of that, Larry? I like that. Yeah. I think that's pretty cool. Should I scare her out of the wrapping man? Yeah. What do I leave her in there for? <clears throat> we'll keep the tin. There you go. Wow. That is... That is quite cool. 
<clears throat> yeah, it's got all the characters there, all the, the famous ones from DC. Yeah. We've got Cheetah as well, who's going to be in the upcoming film. Oh, yeah. Uh, Wonder Woman 2. She's going to be the... Uh, the when does that there. come out? Uh, oh, I'd be lying if I, if, I, if I said to you, Kiri. Um, because of what's happening, all the films yeah, have been, been delayed. Right. Yeah, they've all been. Well, have you heard all the cinema world, cinemas yeah, yeah. are closing in the UK? Yeah, so freaking crazy, man. All the films are sort of like being pushed, <clears throat> pushed back. Yeah, well, some have been pushed back. Some they've released straight onto DVD. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some they've put onto Netflix and Disney Plus. Yeah, but I've seen the trailer <clears throat> for uh, Wonder Woman too, and yeah. it looks amazing. So looking forward to that. Come on, okay. let's get the next one up, Mr. Larry. Right, uh, let's go for. Oh. oh, that looks quite big. This is big, this one. Oh, oh wow. Oh, I'm... oh, <laughs> Jabba the Hutt. He's really cool. Yeah. Let's show that to the boys and girls at home. That is really cool. Chubby, <laughs> <laughs> why are you being so mean? <laughs> to be honest with you, I've never seen that before. Stackable characters, okay. And there's a whole range that you can collect, so that's really cool. I'm really curious. Like, yeah, it's Jabba the Hutt and his entourage. What did you think of Jabba the Hutt as a character when you oh, first saw him? Great. Was it number three he was in when we first saw him? He wasn't in the first one. No, he's 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 Return first introduced in Return of the Jedi. Yeah, but uh, when George Lucas went back and revisited the originals, he he put him in Star Wars because there was a, there was there was a because Jabba the Hutt was going to be human initially. Okay, and there's a scene where he's uh, talking to Han Solo, and uh, as a human, he's like. And then, oh. and then, when George Lucas went 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 back to to do them again, he uh, he put Jabba the Hutt in as the oh, okay. as the I alien know, creature. Uh, yeah, he, so so. What do you think? Yeah, of that? yeah, I think that's uh, that's nice. <laughs> yeah, I, I could, I could different. See, yeah, I could see how people could get into these and start collecting them. Yeah. That is quite yeah. sick. Yeah. yeah. Oh. So far, I'm not sure who's winning. I, I think he might just be edging it a bit. Yeah. Um, I think I'm ahead at the moment. Just, just, a just a bit. So there's supposed to be, I think there's supposed to be about four items in each one. Oh, that's interesting. Joker. Oh, you can't go wrong with a Joker. Tiki's, they're called. Stackable vinyl Tiki figures. Okay. So you can stack them all up with like a totem pole. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. Look at the, yeah, si yeah. the side art on that. That is really yeah. cool. You know what? So let's get him out of the box. Who was your favourite Joker? Um, when you think Joker, who's the first one that you're like? No, the one that, that, that comes to mind is the, the original Batman series. From the 60s. Yeah, yeah. Um, look at there, you guys. He's got his flat head, so one of the others can sit on it. <laughs> That is really cool. There is some really amazing detail on that. And is it actually... I think it might actually be made of wood as well. But, um, you've had some outstanding performances. You've got Jack Nicholson. He's yeah, my yeah, favourite. Yeah. Him and, yeah. and from the um, Heath original Ledger, series. Yeah, Heath Ledger was, was, was amazing. And the I haven't one. seen... Oh, yeah, I haven't seen um, uh, uh, the new Joker. one. Yeah, with uh, uh, Phoenix. With the, King Phoenix. I haven't seen that one, but uh, he won an Oscar. He you won an Oscar, what? so it must be good. I wasn't too keen on actually watching that. And yeah. one night I was sitting at home and we put it on. I don't think it was Netflix. I can't remember what we watched it on. Yeah. We just put it on. Me and my wife sat there and watched it. And you know what? Yeah. It's a twisted film, but it was bloody good. Yeah. I really enjoyed it. And I didn't think I would. Yeah. I didn't think yeah. I would. I thought it was bloody amazing. Worth watching. If you ain't seen it, see it. Yeah, see yeah. it. Yeah, I will do. Watch will it. Do. Yeah. yeah, but Heath Ledger was amazing as well as the, in the dark room. Oh, happy that. So, your turn, Mr. Larry. Okay. Small one. Oh, another, another coin. coin. 
another coin. This time it's a it's a scout trooper. So yeah, and this one is again it's a limited edition. They only made a thousand, and this is five hundred and thirty-one. Well, I'll show it to the yeah. camera. Give us some background on the Scout Troopers. Well, the Scout Troopers uh, are seen in Return of the Jedi, if you remember, on the planet Endor. Uh, uh, yeah, part of the really cool. Galactic Empire, another unit. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, that's nice too. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. it looks like I've got another bombshell. Okay, I was hoping for big figures. When I say big figures, I don't mean Hulk. <laughs> What's this one? It's another bombshell, the uh, DC bombshells. Okay. Yep. Oh, who's that? Let me find a few while I. She's at the top. Oh, here she is. Far down. Other. Yeah. Oh, well, that's one that got by me because to be honest, I don't know who Barda is. Yeah, to be honest with you, I'm a little bit flummoxed as well. Uh, flummoxed? Yeah. That is such a cool word. What the <laughs> hell does that mean? <laughs> He's flummoxed. <laughs> <laughs> Just came to me, sorry. <laughs> Guys, I don't know if that's a word. <laughs> what would you say her name was? <laughs> Barda. If anyone can fill us in, yeah, leave I'm a comment sure below. Who knows. is Barda? Yeah. The others I know, but that one. Yeah, um, hmm. it's quite a cool figure, and it's nice to have two of them anyway. So you know, I was a big fan of Smallville, like the early years before before Clark Kent becomes Superman. So a lot of the character, a lot of the characters were, uh, were get, sort of like get made guest appearances in that. Mm. So there's a lot of characters that are here that were in that were in because uh, they do a lot of Smallville. crossover stuff. Yeah, yeah. Um, so but. Barda, I, I I don't know. So I remember Sorry. watching um, Flash yeah. with my son, yeah, um, and the the series, yeah. And who's the who is it that's in it all the time? The other superhero, the bow and arrow, um, the Green Arrow. Yeah, was it Green Arrow? Yeah. And it was it was just weird yeah, to yeah, see yeah, how yeah, they yeah, yeah. cross over and the superheroes yeah, yeah. know each other by yeah, name yeah. and yeah. It's okay. I've got my two. On shows and my joke out. Let's see what Larry could have bought. Oh, we've got some bubbles. Okay, uh, let's go for. Yeah, oh my Ooh. god. This is heavy. This oh one. my god. Ooh. Okay, wow. That. Well, you know me, I love my mugs. And that's uh, the 40th anniversary as well. Yeah, that's nice. Wow. Look, I don't know if you're. Viewers can see that. Yeah, they they will see that, and that is a big mug as well. There you go, from Star Wars. Oh, you got Chew back on the, the front with cars. Leia, uh, Han Solo, yeah. Luke, obviously. It's fortieth anniversary. What does it say? There's another one in the set as well. What's the other one? May the force oh, be with you. Be that with might you. actually be. That's the back. That's what it yeah. says on the back. May the force be with you. Yeah. That flipping heck! Yeah, yeah. Me, that that is an awesome pull. Yeah, that That's is nice. an awesome pull. That's nice. That's a big mug. <laughs> well, if the stuff in these weren't any good, I would have been in a big mug. <laughs> yeah, yeah man. nice one. So far, so good. Oh, and this is my last thing. Oh, wow. Okay, I'll take that off after. Wow. You see the detail on this. You know what? I'm not going to lie. I have got absolutely no idea who this is. I'm going to have a I look. I think it's Deathstroke. Am I right? Or... Yeah. Yes, you are. Yeah. Wow. Look, that, that, that is... That's nice. That is mean. He's got that where the blade, the, the sword goes in. What do you think of that? Is that wow. box? It actually is, yeah. I just thought it was a bust figure, but hey, if it doubles up as a money box, I can yeah. put all my loose change in here yeah. and buy my pops. My wife will never know where the <laughs> money is. 
He'll be looking after you, man. No one will mess with you. Well, you haven't seen her. Actually, yes, you have. <laughs> I'm a dead man. Uh, that is flipping awesome. Wow. Like yeah. yeah. Love it. <clears throat> Mr. Lurry. Okay. Do you want to get your last item out as well? Uh, yeah. Uh, so, Tim, I think you've go. got one more thing oh. than I did, which I ain't bitter about. Hey, oh. Funko Pop. Uh, Fox is a bit. Um, Oh, then yeah. at the top, a oh, rose, and it's rose. And it's an exclusive as well. Yeah, rose. it's rose from the Last Jedi and the Rise of Skywalker. Nice. Yeah. Do you know much about Rose? Um, well, Rose was one of the Resistance fighters in um, the Last Jedi, and she uh, she f she featured quite a lot in the Last Jedi. But then, for some reason, they sort of uh, they didn't have much of her in the rise of Skywalker okay. so they really didn't develop her character um so there, there was there was a, at, at one point you thought that there might be sort of a romance between her and uh, uh, uh Finn's character uh in the well, film Finn. Well, yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> in, in, in the film but um uh -huh. yeah but they really didn't sort of like develop it and develop her character any further but there you go, that's um, yeah. our exclusive Star Wars figure. There's the rest of the collection. Side window. And there's the artwork on the side. The top of the box has been a bit dented in. What can you do? It's savvy, in it? I ain't going to sit here moaning about it because I'm all moaned out. <laughs> So let's okay. grab our bits that we've got. There's yeah. <clears throat> Larry's. Let's go through either my job as it hurt. So Larry got the two coins, we got the rose pop. The 40th anniversary mug, which is wicked. It's awesome. Jabba the Hut and Co. You know what? For a £20 box or 25 I think that's good value. Yeah. Um, these figures ain't going to be less than a tenner. The, the mug's probably the best part of the because it's a big mug. Them coins are probably yeah. about that as well. Remember, the coins are limited edition. Yeah, so... but they've got to be at least a tenner, yeah, yeah, surely, yeah, to buy. And Rose... I don't think it's one of the most expensive pops, but actually somewhere between five and ten pounds yeah. easily. So I think that was a pretty good box. Uh, with mine, I've got my two DC bombshells, the Joker, and we got what do you call him? Deathstroke. Deathstroke, <laughs> mm -hmm. which which is really cool. Yeah. Now, is that all I bloody got? You know what? I feel shortchanged on my box. I think. Is it safe to say you won that? I think so. Yeah, I, I would be happy. Don't look so smug. No, 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 because no, no, no. I'm a I'm a huge DC fan as well. So, but if out of the two, I um, yeah, well, hell yeah, yeah, I'd be happy. Goes about saying, guys, yeah. leave your comments below. You tell us what you think. Now, it's pretty obvious that Larry's is a better box, but tell us your thoughts. What did you like from these two boxes? What didn't you like? And you know what? We're going to have Larry back another time. We're going to do another video. I've got some good ideas. Yeah. Guys, give us your likes. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell. And we'll see you soon for another video. Peace. You, no, you, you missed it. You missed it. Peace. Oh. Peace. Peace. And turn. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <You get it. laughs> uh... <laughs>